Hello and welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Europa Universe House 4, All Belongs to Mother Russia. We're pretty much just waiting to get to Admin Tech 10. I think in the meantime we'll nibble on Kazan. Crimea... I don't know, who are they allied with? Let's take a gander. Allied with the Ottomans, Nagai, Nogai, and Chagatai. We're not gonna go into an offensive war with them. I highly doubt Denmark would even think about coming with us because they're too far away. I'm curious, let's see. Nope. Why? Distant war. Mm-hmm. Jerk. Yeah, we'll help you. We'll be allies unless you're too far away. Right, 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 right. So, pretty much nibble on... Nibble on Kazan, go to war with Novgorod again when we can in 1503. Three years left. A little less than three years. Don't care about too few rivals. Trading in fur, yay. Military access from Sweden, sure. From an alliance from the Livonian Order. I'm just not interested. You're so small, it's cute. From Norway, yeah, I know. No, not from Pomerania. Pomerania is allied with Novgorod. We don't like Novgorod. It'd be pointless to go to war with him right now. Wow, our opinion of Novgorod is now 100. Plus 39. Plus 40. They really want that we don't hate them. You may not start a war with someone that you have a transfer trade power relation with. Interesting. Gain 7 manpower. And Betluga, 5,000 manpower. Alright. I'll take that. Now here's something. I just don't like it. It's just, in my opinion, a bad idea. If I can find it. It's not trade. Where are you going to be at? Is it here? Yeah, but it's our country. Here we go. Receiving trade power from Novgorod is now considered a diplomatic relation, which is crap. I don't know if it always was like that from what I've noticed. It, it never jumped out at me. I never saw anybody else have like, oh yeah, I have an alliance with Denmark and receiving trade power from Novgorod. So I can only have two more. I've always seen him like alliance with them, alliance with them, royal marriage with these guys, and then receiving trade power was just icing on the cake. But now it's kind of like a penalty. And here you go, England stepping up. Moving in on Scotland. Austria is still webbing out. Savoy's got rebel problems. France is occupied by Portugal. Yeah. Whoa. Portugal's... I think he's been like that for a while, actually. Algiers is quite large. Morocco's... We can't even see Morocco anymore. The Mamluks have not really changed that much, have they? I think Tripoli used to have Barca. Looks like the Timurids are large. I think they start out not that large. Oh, great. Friggin' A. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> oh, that sucks so much. I'm so sick of this. Lose 62 ducats, 50% chance he'll die. And he died. No air. 
We are airless. But our dude is only 22, so we're good to go. Did anybody else... I just realized, actually. Did anyone else realize that he had a, a son at 15? I mean, that's not weird for 1500 king. But, holy crap. They're pushing it out there. New legal heir, 635 weak claim, or... One of three things will happen. Lose 5 prestige and you can get a bunch of guys you don't need. I guess I'll just take the weak claim, lose 10 prestige, and pretty, pretty good little leader. But the original heir was a weak, had a weak, weak claim as well. So it's just something we're gonna have to deal with. Yay! Still no advisor that I care about. Actually, let's just do it. Why not? We need the admin points. Recall. Brandenburg. Denmark wants a royal marriage. I don't want one. Hungary loves us. They're like, hey man, what's going on? You are some cool cats. But we don't want an alliance with you because we don't have a good opinion of you. Well, let's change that. I don't really want an alliance with you, but I don't want you to hate me either. Serbia is neutral. They're like, yeah, we don't care. Who are you? Australia? Yeah, we already maxed them out, didn't we? Pomerania? That would be handy. Get a, they, they're friendly towards us, but they're allied with our... Oh, they're not allied with them anymore. You are friendless. <laughs> no friends. That must have, oh yeah, because I went to war with them last time, and Palmerini didn't join in, so that must have broken their alliance. Look at that. We are blessed. Lots of money. Wow, we have too much money. I need to build crap. Buildings. Not, that's not buildings. Buildings, yay. Some temples. Let's rock some temples. Heck yeah. What does that take? It takes admin power. Let's build something that doesn't need admin power, shall we? Like, not military power either. There you go. A dock. Let's build a dock right there. The only place we can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A marketplace, which increases local trade power. Constable. Local production efficiency. A courthouse. Also admin power. Let's stick to diplo power for now, shall we? Looks like Marketplace is going to be the winner here. Marketplace! Everywhere is an increase of 1.2. So we'll just pretty much start here and work that way. Why not? Control trade power. And there's that. <laughs> Marketplaces. Constables. I think... Yeah, man. I would really like to build some temples, but I don't want to spend the admin power. Gotta get to admin tech 10. ASAP. ASAP. We're almost there. Production efficiency plus 10%. We're getting cannons this next round. Ooh. That might be worth the wait. Oh, look at that. We can... Oh, yeah, it's going down. I have no diplomats. Well, hold on. You're in Serbia. You're in Pomerania. You're in Hungary. Let's bring you home, shall we? Yes, please. 35 days.
You're the one with the leader. Oh, they both have a leader. This is the better leader. Come this way. Who are you? Military access from Austria. Why would Austria want military access to my domain? Let us ponder. Because they have it through everyone else, why not? Warning a bunch of people. Are they at war? They're at war with Denmark, Sweden, Nor. Denmark didn't call me in. I'm grateful because I would have said no, but dang. They don't have any reason to go through me. Unless they're also trying to get it through, because they got it through Livonian Order, Poland, which also gives it to Lithuania, if I'm not mistaken, Lorraine. So instead of going north to Denmark, they want to go all the way around to Sweden. I'm going to say no. Negative. Negative, sir. Even though they didn't call me in, I can't allow you to just beat up on my dude like that. Not cool, bro. Once everybody gets in position, we will just crush their face. Let's just crush their face anyway. We are going to take... I thought for sure cargo pole was here last time. Oh, now all the buildings are just starting to... Yep, 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 buildings. Buildings like crazy. Uh-huh. Lots of buildings. Gotcha. Mm-hmm. More. More. Yes. Wonderful. We will take... Col... Colmagory. Right there. <laughs> sure. Who are you? No. Maybe Neva. We'll take Neva so that we can have more... Well, we'd have it with either one, I guess. I don't care. Any, meeny, miny, mo. They wouldn't come because they're getting their butts whooped. They're in debt. More exhaustion. Fighting in another war. Yeah. They're not coming. Whoa! Can never have too much manpower. Lose 30 admin points, gain 10 revolt risk in all in it. Where always all in it? Okay. I spelled it wrong. No, I didn't. Oh, low nets. Not an E. There you are. Wait. Oh, I'm standing on you. Currently zero. Well, I don't want to lose the admin power, honestly. We'll just get the revolt risk. 2.3. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We to declare war on you. To declare war with you, I will. I can't declare you as a rival, though, because... No. I guess. Nobody knows why. Somebody knows why. They just don't want to tell me. We'll take... Which one? Let's see. Hold on. Two base stacks. Two base stacks. I wouldn't have a culture problem here. They are nationalist. I think Kolmogori wins. Why not? What's the... Um, 20 supply limit, 26 supply limit, 9 manpower, 12 manpower. <laughs> yeah, we'll just take Kolmogori. Take Kolmogori. Kolmogori. Put the emphasis on the right syllable. Declare one. Is this the good one? The better one, I meant. None of them are any good. Let it begin. 
And there goes our fleet. Oh yeah, hardcore. <laughs> Military leader has died. Of course he has. Our fortress is under siege. Yes, yes, yes. Our crappy leader died. So we got a worse one. He's not worse. Eh, whatever. One, one, three, one. At least he's got some maneuver. That's kind of handy, I guess. So I will take you. Leader up. Go back. Hey, we can get stuff. Minus 10% land modifier or one year of the army tradition, or we can wait and get cannons. I think we will wait and get cannons. Oh my gosh, look at that. We're so close. We have engaged the enemy. The enemy will die. And there's admin tech. Yippee, admin tech. Plus 10% production efficiency. Where are they going? Komagori, look at that. So are we. Mustard, shut up. Recall. Where are they going? Cola. Coca Cola. Again? Seriously? Just gonna keep on killing off my guys. <sighs> You're so annoying. Squishy, squishy. Ah, they enacted another imperial reform. Norway doesn't want us to come in here anymore. We sieged a place. Our fortress is under siege. How unfortunate.
there. What is that? Too few men to siege the province. Okay. Lose 10 army tradition. Well, oh, bite me game. Come on, cannons. Free leader. I'll take it. Come on down. Lose one inflation. That's handy. I bet your inflation's disgusting right now. Oh yeah. We were at five and a half percent. Woof. Admin points to lose two. Man. Those marketplaces did a number though. That's nice. Jumped us up like three, like two and a half gold a month. Two and a half ducats a month. Hot dog. And we took cargo bowl. Throw you over there. Hmm. Isn't this nice? Denmark still wants a royal marriage. I still don't. Another siege is done. Hooray! Denmark, you silly guy. Alright. Why are we only at 80? Oh, we haven't. <laughs> I was like, what the heck, man? Come on. Just want to be friends. Just give me your stuff. I wonder if this time I could make him a vassal. That'd be neat. Novgorod vassal. Then they would do my bidding. Go forth and do my bidding, little Novgorod. Come on, take it. We gotta put a break in the video, man. You can do it. I know you don't have any cannons, but you can. I promise. Okay, this time you can do it. This time you can do it. Oh my gosh. Speed 5. Nope. Nope. Oh, come on. I don't understand a lot of the stuff, how it works. Phase progress modifier. From not being blockaded. Would it help to set a buttload of guys here? Just be like mass army. Yep. <laughs> that did her. 
All right. Send all these guys back to Novgorod where they have a ridiculously high supply limit, 30. And that'll support almost my entire army. And then we peace out. First we see if, the oh, they will. Oh yes, it's beautiful. And money, give me your money. I will take out all, send demand, you are mine. Oh yes, beautiful. Austria wants to be our friend. So does Lithuania and Bohemia, apparently. All right, we just vassalized Novgorod. Really? Trade efficiency, yeah. 10 years, it's a long time. But I don't, I don't wanna have to pay for stability. Ninety-six admin power? No way, man. No way. We're just gonna have to deal with this for ten years. All right. So, in a while, <laughs> wherever it's at. Here it is. In 10 years. That's it, really? Cool. 10 years and get them up to 190 opinion and we are golden. Let's go ahead and improve relations. Yeah. And that's what we're going to look like. We're going to gobble them up in about 10 years. Next round I expect will be munching on Kazan for a while. Wow, Livonian Order is having some rebel problems. Let's take a look at everybody. England swallowed all of Scotland. Scotland is gone. Now it's just cannot. They'll swallow them up, no problem. Aragon is having some serious French problems. Looks like Portugal never actually did anything with France. Provence exists. Were they there before? Savoy looks a little bit bigger, maybe one or two provinces. They're gobbling up Milan. Ferrara is also gobbling up Milan. The Papal State is a little bit larger now. They usually start as one, a one province minor. They're up to three provinces. Aragorn's having some problems. The Ottomans are... Be oh, Venice? What? <laughs> what is Venice doing over here? Nice. So somehow the Mamluks got some land right here, and Venice is occupying it. Cyprus as well. The Ottomans have done almost nothing. The Byzantines are spreading. That's nice. Sardinia is still their own deal. Bohemia's got rebel problems. The Hansa looks a little bit bigger from the last time I saw him. Denmark is still getting their butt kicked. Pretty hardcore. Pomerania, Teutonic Order, Anhalt, and, Sil and what? Silesia. Awesome. They keep on going to war and not inviting me. They must have learned that first time. If we invite them, they'll say no, and then we won't be friends anymore. I don't want to be friends with the Livonian Order. They're just problematic. They're always a war. Always. So that's the world. Can't wait to see Asia, the New World, see how it's all turning out in Africa. Heck yeah, it'll be great. This game's going kind of weird. I'm taking my time taking over Novgorod, which usually happens at no time. Sweden did not gain their independence, which is... I've actually never seen that in one of my games. They always gain their independence. England took a really long time to, to, to beat down Scotland and cannot still exist, which is awkward. Algiers is... That's all I can see. Usually Algiers stops about here, and that's Morocco. Portugal swooped in, took a bunch of Morocco, and Algiers took the rest. Tunisia is still doing nothing. I think they might have taken one province from Tunisia as well. 
and I don't remember for sure, but I think the Mamluks took Barca from Tripoli. I'm not sure. Here's Venice down here. Byzantines. Poland, Lithuania, Hungary, Serbia. Yeah, it's all going nicely. We'll continue it at a later time. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye-bye.